A woman's home hit by a teen driving a stolen car at the end of a police chase got some much needed TLC. That is thanks to the generosity of the community. Two of your sides, Brittany Wise has this update. Connie Bailey's home was hit by a car in March. Almost two months later, she finally has a new porch and a lot to be thankful for. My sanctuary. I get my joy out of sitting on my porch. This is Connie Bailey's happy place. A brand new screened in porch. What do you think about it? I think everything about it. I could sit on my porch as long as I want. Those are her plans. Plans that were dealt a curveball a few weeks ago. I heard some bang, and then my house shook. A car ran into her home, and the one next door. It was being chased by police. The crash knocking out her gas meter and her beloved sitting place. It's amazing to know that people still care the way they do. Neighbor Michael Cluart called me when the city denied her claim. The city of Baton Rouge is not liable for any of these damages. Her front porch held up by jacks. She didn't have hot water or gas to her stove. People responded eager to help, fixing her gas meter. They didn't know her from Adam, but they were compelled to come forward and help her. Matt Browning, who saw the story, collected donations and built Bailey a new screened-in porch. And um, she considers them her angels. Now she has her, as you refer to, her happy place, all restored. Oh, I, I love Mr. Browning for this. Mr. Browning and his company gave me my life back. The porch repairs were done over the weekend. There were enough donations to also buy Bailey a new washing machine. To On Your Side in Baton Rouge, Brittany Weiss, WBRZ News 2.